The following video provides an introduction to the Mosca ROM Fusion Strapping Machine. This video is intended for quick reference and does not replace the operation manual that is provided. Please refer to the introduction and safety procedures outlined in Chapter 1 before operating this machine. Let's begin by turning the main power switch to the on position. The main power switch controls incoming power to the entire unit. A few seconds after the main switch is turned on, the main indicator light will illuminate and begin to flash or remain on steady. This multicolor indicator helps the operator understand the status of the machine. Upon powering up, this light will typically flash red indicating that the heater is coming up to temperature or that the machine has run out of strap. The heater takes approximately one minute to reach operating temperature. If there are no faults detected within the machine, the indicator light will change from flashing red to a steady green indicating the machine is ready for strap. If the indicator light continues to flash red for more than a minute, check to see if the machine has run out of strap or needs to be threaded. To thread the strap, begin by opening the front door of the machine. Please note, there is a threading instruction label located on the inside of the door panel if needed. Turn the dispenser knob counterclockwise and remove the outer spool cover. Remove and discard all cardboard items remaining from the empty spool. Install a new strap spool on the dispenser, making sure it unwinds in the direction of the yellow arrows. Remove all protective shipping materials from the new strap spool. Guide the strap end over the first roller and down into the guide marked with the red arrow. Press on the foot bar to release and unroll more strap from the spool as needed. Continue inserting strap into the guide area until resistance is felt. Next, pivot the pressure roller assembly down while pushing approximately 4 more inches of strap into the feed area. Close the front door and step on the foot bar to thread the strap into the machine. If threading is complete, the indicator light will turn to solid green indicating the machine is ready to strap. And finally, if the indicator light is a steady red condition, this will indicate that a safety switch is open. Check to make sure all doors and tables are properly closed. Once all safety switches are closed, the indicator light will change from red to a steady green indicating the machine is ready to strap. Now that the machine is ready to apply straps, Let's discuss the strapping and tension modes available on the ROM Fusion machine. A strapping cycle can be initiated by pushing the main indicator push button, pressing on the foot bar, or by an optional photo control. For manual strapping, set the selector switch to the hand icon. Place a bundle in the center of the machine, keeping your hands clear of the strapping area. Apply a single strap by pushing the green indicator button or pressing the foot bar once. If more than one strap is desired, push and hold in the green indicator button or press and hold down on the foot bar. Release when the desired number of straps have been applied to the product. To strap using the photo eye, select the appropriate strapping mode, single or continuous. In the photo single mode, one strap will be applied to the product each time the photo eye is blocked. The photo eye must be cleared before another strap can be applied. The continuous mode applies multiple straps as long as the photo eye remains blocked. Strapping will stop when the bundle is removed from the machine and the photo eye is cleared. For optimum strapping results, tension can be adjusted depending upon the type of product being strapped. The ROM Fusion machine features a soft tension, adjustable tension, and a tension memory mode. The soft tension mode is used to strap delicate product. To activate this feature, first verify that the tension selector switch is in the adjustable tension mode. Second, press the soft tension push button. A white light will come on indicating that the machine is now in the soft tension mode. Please note that the tension dial is deactivated when in the soft tension mode. To disable soft tension, press the button again. Notice that the indicator light turns off. In the adjustable tension mode, the tension dial can be turned anywhere from a setting of 1 for low tension all the way up to a setting of 10 for maximum tension as needed. This mode is beneficial when strapping a wide variety of product. Lastly, the tension memory feature allows a tension setting to be stored when it is critical for strap tension to remain unchanged for a particular type of product. Please note that the tension dial is deactivated when using the tension memory mode. 
To use this feature, begin with the tension selector switch in the adjustable tension position. Set the tension dial to the desired setting. Once the tension dial is set, turn off the machine using the main power switch. After the machine is powered down a few seconds, turn the tension selector switch to the tension memory position. Next, press and hold down the foot bar while turning the power back on to the machine. As the machine powers up, the main indicator light will flash green signifying it has accepted the tension value. If no additional faults are detected, the indicator light will turn to a steady green indicating the machine is ready to strap. While operating the machine, a strap jam can occur. When a fault is encountered, the main indicator light will flash red and the strap track will automatically open. Most strap jams are easily cleared in a few simple steps. Begin by opening the tabletop or necessary doors to interrupt the safety circuit. Use extra caution when working near the heater to avoid risk of a burn injury. Always work as if the heater is hot. Visibly check for the strap jam and carefully clear from the strap path area. While holding the loose end of strap, press on the foot bar to cut the strap and reset the machine. If no additional faults are detected, the indicator light will turn to a steady green indicating the machine is ready to strap. To keep the machine running at optimum performance, it is important to maintain your machine as outlined in the preventive maintenance section in the service manual supplied with this machine. The ROM Fusion is equipped with a toolless guide system for fast cleaning and servicing. The next few steps will detail how to access the most common areas for preventive maintenance on this machine. Start by shutting the machine power off and install a lockout tagout device to the main power switch. The machine should always be locked out whenever it is being serviced to ensure the safety of all personnel. Once the heater has cooled down, open the front table. For additional access, the swing table can be easily removed by disengaging the spring-loaded pin while lifting up on the table. Begin by removing the pressure lever by pivoting the left side up so the arm can clear the bolt and slide it off the pin. Be careful not to lift the arm too high or the spring can become overstretched and damaged. If necessary, tilt the pressure roller assembly down for additional cleaning access. To remove the upper strap guide, swing open the latch, lift up on the guide and remove from the assembly. To remove the lower tension guide, start by disengaging the spring latch and remove the pivot pin. Once the pin is removed, pull out the pivot arm and lower the tension lever. Next, tilt the tension guide to the right and lift up to remove from the assembly. Please note that this guide has a notch used to help align it when being installed. Finally, remove and clean the slide plate assembly which is located on the other side of the machine. To access the slide plate, take off the rear table by using a 3mm Allen wrench. Once all the hardware is loose, slide the table top back and lift up to remove. Remove the slide plate assembly by grasping the lever and pulling back far enough for the slide plate to clear the sealer housing. Take extra caution not to pinch your fingers when releasing the lever. Use compressed air to clear out any dirt and debris within the slide plate and strap path areas. Always be sure to wear the proper eye protection when using compressed air. Once cleaned, simply reassemble all components in the reverse order. The ROM Fusion Bundler is one of many bundling solutions provided by EAM Mosca. With proper care and maintenance, this machine will offer consistent performance and reliable operation for many years. For additional help and support for this machine or any other Mosca strapping system, please contact us at 1-800-456-3420 or email us through our website at www.eammosca.com.